Welcome back to the basement, the friendliest place on YouTube. It is lightning, it is thundering, we have some stuff to sell. You know, can I talk to this guy? Insect head. Not very pleasant to wield. Level 6 sword. Let's see, 30 to 45, negative 1 speed, plus 10 crit power. Nope. I don't, I don't want that. Can I get out of here? Wait, how do I get out of here? <laughs> Is that the only way? Shop. Yeah, oh, we can sell these. Two fifty. May as well. And we have so much stinking stuff. Maybe we should go home and drop some things off. We could kill the last 10 skeletons, though. It's only 2 p.m. Let's give it a try. Got full health and nearly full energy. I think it's worth a try. Uh, okay, looking for skeletons, but also ores. You guys know the drill. There's a skeleton. We're trying to kill 50 skeletons to grab a reward. I don't know how good it's going to be. Whoop, whoop. All right. Goodness gracious, what a bunch of wasted energy. We're off to a slow start in the mines today. We're looking. Hey, I got iron and coal from that rock. Sometimes you do. I'd love to get some good stuff from a big rock sometime. It seems like it's always just a bunch of stone. I remember when that used to scare me. There's our ladder. That sound and then all the bats and stuff. It's pretty tame though. Uh, by our standards now. We haven't succumbed in the mines in quite a while. Knock on wood, you know, because we still could, of course. Anything other than stone? Am I going to need a lot of stone to, like, build something at some point? There's this guy I saw earlier. Taking the long way. Monster Slayer, goal complete. See Gil for your reward. Who's Gil? Oh, not that one. A different one. Gil is the guy we just talked to, right? That we sold our bone swords to? wonder what the reward's going to be. I hope it's uh, 25000 I want to buy that lava sword. Okay, 43, 44, 45, I think. Frozen tier. 46? Yes. The lava crabs are probably floor 80 and below, right? 47. There's our ladder. Um, sap? That's not good. It just clogs the inventory. Is that 47? There's a skeleton. Forty-nine. One more skeleton. There he is. New achievement. Gopher. What? I don't know what that is. Kill 50 skeletons? Leave the mine. Okay, let's talk to Gil and Clint. I guess we'll talk to Clint tomorrow when we have him upgrade our axe. But we'll talk to Gil right now and we'll sell our extra sword. Greetings. You're Gil, right? Uh, we're going to sell this. Might as well sell those too. Is this Gil? 
skeleton mask. Red eyes are glowing mysteriously. Oh, I just took it. That's a reward? What does it do? Can I put it on? <laughs> that might be a bad idea. Okay, can we sell it? That's a good question. No, we can't. We can sell the gel. Or slime. Okay, we got enough to talk to Clint, so I guess we'll do that. Uh, who? Yeah, Cave Patrol. 6,000. That's a big chunk of change. Bounty lava crab. Well, maybe we should go for the lava crabs. It's just 700, though. That would be here, right? Do I have to hit them with the pickaxe in order to wake them up? Or can I just hit them with a sword? I don't know. Don't know, don't know, don't know. It's weird to start an episode without watering the props. Bro. I didn't take you as seriously as I should have. A little gold ore is not a bad thing. Yeah, some of these red things are supposed to be those lava crab monsters. Hardwood. There's one. Ooh, my health is very low. Okay, one of four. Might as well eat it. Wow, that does a lot. Maybe I should have saved it. But we're at one of four. Um... As long as we only attack the red things. Shouldn't be too much of a waste, right? He don't want to accidentally do that. And the gold yielded us a ladder as well. Okay, any one of these red things could be another crab. So I say we finish this floor take a peek at the next. Or one tough little guy. Fibers. Okay. Did I get a ladder? I did. So we're going to take a peek at the next floor and then get out of here because it's 10.30 p.m. Just a peek. Just a little peek. Try hitting these guys with swords. Good. I don't know if swinging your sword at the red guys is enough. Ooh, we want this. For sure. Gosh, they do a lot of damage. Uh-oh. Ooh, a bomb. We could try it. Okay, I gotta go. I gotta get home. It's 11.20 p.m. Uh, we have a very full inventory anyway. Okay, so we gotta... Um, I don't know if I'm concerned about the lava crab thing or not. We gotta go to Clint and upgrade our... Ooh, wild plum. Upgrade our axe. 
and uh, we got to make sure we do the giftings for the week. I'm not sure. We're done with some and half done with some, I do believe. It's getting late, so we'll just go to bed and in the morning we'll put away our stuff. Okay, our bed's further away than it used to be. Hello, kitten. We, I just realized we could, we have so much space in that bedroom. We could put a lot of, one egg. We could put a lot of uh, decorations in there. Okay, progress saved. That's good. Uh, we gotta handle our inventory. What does the fortune teller say today? Very happy. Okay, probably a good day for something or other. Um, okay, first things first. What are we gonna sell? That, that, uh, this? I don't know what we build with those. We could put them away though. Okay, so now we check check our chests in order. Get things put away appropriately. We're going to Clint, so we'll keep the geodes on us. That goes in there, that goes in there, that goes in there. Uh, I think the corn will go in there too. Salad's obviously a gift we have to give. Uh, this, nope, not that. Those other things though, yes. Okay, in here. We have, uh, keeping that, keeping that, that goes up there, I do believe, except this is gift. This goes, this goes, this goes, this goes, this goes, uh, this, and I think we've been selling these, but maybe they're worth keeping in here. Seems like they might be. Okay, this goes in here. This goes in here. Uh, and this, and this. Right, bombs? Not bombs, bombs go in here. What else goes in here? Uh, the mask, I suppose. And the chair, I guess? Okay, in here, gifts. That's a gift. That's a gift. We're keeping this one on us in case we see Leah. Yeah, like that. Okay, who haven't we gifted? Not Emily. Leah, yes. Abigail, yes. So we just need the salad on us. Okay, we'll pick up these things. We can put them in the chest that they go in, and then we'll check the mail. Whew, we got a lot to do. Peter, I of 500 gold. Heard you've been giving people a hand around town. Everyone seems thankful. I'm awarding you with this month's best neighbor award. Small cash prize. Keep it up, Mayor. Thanks. Uh, hello. Thank you for clearing. Help me clear out all these monsters. I'm not scared at all. But it should make the mine safer for everyone else, right? Take the blueprint. Hopefully, it doesn't make me obsolete. Clint the blacksmith. Geode crusher. <gasps> we can make a geode crusher. How do we make it? Um. Worm bin. Where's the geode crusher? That's a crab pot. Maybe this? Two gold, 50 stone, one diamond. Breaks geodes open automatically. Cool. Well, since we're going to Clint to upgrade our axe, we won't build that yet. Okay. Notice the chill in the air. It could be the approach of winter. Or it could be the tingle of the dark specter here to celebrate tomorrow's festival, Spirits Eve. Come to town at 10 p.m. if you'd like to participate. That sounds kind of spooky. Okay, let's get our water. And water our crops. We're also going to water the cat. Take the eggs. Take the mushrooms. 
And, uh... Oh, I watered that one twice by accident. I see some eggplants. Do we want to hang on to one of those? I have heard that sometimes people ask for those. And we're doing okay on money, so maybe we... Just stick those in a chest somewhere, like the gift chest. Maybe Abigail would like one since she's got purple hair. Dang it. Some of these that I'm watering aren't gonna do anything. Hello, chicken. Oh, I'm out of water. Okay, we need to do the last three on the fourth row. That's how many mistakes I had. Or maybe I had two mistakes. Because I always have to do the last one on the fourth row. Maybe that's without mistakes. Don't know. Am I am rewatering stuff right now? I've got some new ideas to sleep on. What does that mean? Got some corn. I don't know if any of this is gonna bloom before winter. We'll see. Little mistakes with the watering can aren't that big of a deal because you only use like one and a half water per time. Let's check in here. Oh, we got to do this. Keep the chickens happy. But yeah, with one and a half cans of water being enough, it's like, okay, well... As long as it doesn't take a third full can to, you know, need to be filled to get done what needs to be get gotten done. Does that make sense? Uh, it's about like division with remainders. It's one with or two with a remainder is what it takes. And even with mistakes, the remainders got you covered. Okay, we're going to save some eggplants. And we're going to sell that, that, and that. And that. We're going to give Leah a salad. Hopefully she's home. Hello, chicken. The chickens seem happy. They don't seem mad that they're out of food. I try to check that every day, and it seems like they don't eat it, they don't eat it, they don't eat it, and suddenly they eat it. I don't know if they're eating the grass while they're out and about. Fly away, little birds. <laughs> or what? Feels weird that the Halloween decorations are up. Ooh, stop by my cabin if you ever need someone to talk to. I need someone to eat salad. Oh, wow, Peter, this is exactly what I was craving. How'd you know? Uh, same answer I gave you last time there, Leah. You're a predictable girl. And you know what? I don't mind. Okay, so now with Penny, Leah, Haley, and Emily, we'll just talk to them. Since we've already gifted them plenty. You look like you've been doing a lot of hard work. Why don't you take the rest of the day off? Because it's not even noon. Smell that clean air? It's lovely, isn't it? I hope Jojo won't take that away from us. I'm not a big fan of the Jojo either. I like Pierre's. It just feels appropriate in a small town, you know? Uh, okay, what am I doing? I'm going to Clint. I got the gold. And the gold bars. What is this? Prize ticket. Why did I get a prize ticket? I don't know. Anyway, we're going to have Clint Processor Geodes. Since he gives us a pretty good deal. Uh, Geminite, good. Iron, good. That's not a thing we can process. Okay, upgrade tools. Gold axe. Thanks, I'll get started on this as soon as I can. Should be ready in a couple of days. Great, okay. At the time it's winter, we can gold axe. Well, can Gunther tell us something about this? Bring this to the prize machine in Lewis's house for a special reward. 
Oh, Lewis is the mayor, right? Okay. We can do that. Did I get that for killing 50 skeletons? I don't know. Oh my! Welcome to clothing therapy. You're probably wondering, what is clothing therapy? I'll try to explain. So many of us are struggling with personal issues, things holding us back from living how we want. It's important to me that everyone has a free and happy life, so I came up with a new kind of therapy to help people achieve that. It's based on the amazing power of self-expression. Self-expression is a wonderful healing tool. Did you know that? Behind this curtain, you'll find racks and racks of clothes. There are endless options to choose from. Not there's endless options. There are endless options to choose from. Is that the Do I blame the game for that? Or did they give Emily imperfect grammar on purpose as a part of her character? Your job is simple. Find the outfit that truly speaks to you and put it on. Feel confident in yourself and your choice. You have a unique style to share with the world. Shane, you're up first. Uh? Okay. <laughs> Shane started out nervous and then he got brave. Ah, Peter, you're just in time. Just observe and keep an open mind, okay? Uh, not so open that my brain falls out, I hope. Wow. Rock and roll. <laughs> Cool. Shane, it's a new side of you we've never known about. That's great. Now go outside with confidence and show the world. Everyone's going to make fun of me. Sure. <laughs> All right, Clint, you're next. Everyone gets a turn. Oh, no. Clint's worried. Who's that that just went in? Jody? <laughs> oh, that's nice. Let's see what Demetrius thinks. Oh, he's gonna love that. Why not, says Lewis. I don't know, with his overall, brown overalls and green shirt and yellow tie. Eh, not bad. <laughs> Dude. Looking sharp. I couldn't have said it better myself. So, do you go in there and actually choose stuff, or is it just kind of random? How long does it last? Is it permanent? I see the prize. Wow. Abigail, you're a knight in shining armor. It's sweaty in here. Yeah, I... Okay, come on, Gus. I mean, Clint. Clint, you're up. Oh, I don't wanna. Mama, ma 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 me Okay, Emily, I'll do it. But only because I think I kinda have a crush on you. I hope this isn't humiliating for poor Clint. What triggered this? Is it 10 hearts with Emily? Is it... <laughs> Aw, cute. That's not what a guy wants to hear. Cute? Ugh. Well, I guess I'm stuck with it. Well, that went very well. I just hope this experience helps everyone break out of their shells a bit. Peter. Um. I couldn't do it. I don't want to break out of my shell. <laughs> ah! <laughs> oh, I guess I'm interrupting something here, aren't I? Oh, Clint. I understand. I'll leave now. Congrats, Peter. Uh? What? What was she going to say? I guess we'll never know. Now we have the other cutscene. The prize ticket cutscene. I triggered multiple cutscenes simultaneously. <laughs> Hello there, Peter. I was just loading some more prizes into this machine here. Prizes? It's a new program I've come up with to help promote the spirit of goodwill among the townsfolk. You included. It's pretty simple. Sometimes, when you help out others in town, you receive a prize ticket. You can turn them in for rewards. There's special stuff in here. Did I just whistle? Is that what the music note means? My only worry is that people will just go after the tickets rather than cultivating a true compassion for their fellow man. That's the problem with incentivization there, Lewis. Um, I just want to help. 
dude, you... Is that so? I'm glad to hear that. At any rate, keep checking the help wanted board in town. That's a good way to get your hands on more tickets. Good luck out there. Thank you. Okay, can I now... Yeah, now I can just do it, right? Okay. Um... What? Powder melon seeds. Oh, and now the next thing is up. Got it. If I had more tickets, I could turn in more tickets. I wonder what powder melon seeds do. Don't know. Uh, it's 12.50 p.m. I've gifted everyone for the week, except Emily, which is okay. Um, saving up for a better sword. Man, what do I do next? I don't know. Uh, is this the thing I could donate to the museum? Let's see. Oh, these special melons grow in winter. It takes seven days to grow. That just seems like something I could sell or gift since it doesn't go in the museum. Uh, okay, let's put this away and this away. Uh, where are the seeds going to go? I guess in here. Keep that spot open for the... Hello, chicken. Wendy looks really happy today. Uh, all right. I gotta run. I got a thing to do. Uh, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Goodbye.